Hey guys, Trevor here, and in this video, I'm gonna walk you through how to save audio messages on your iPhone. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, if somebody sends you an audio message and you want to save it, I'm gonna walk you through a few different steps to be able to save that audio message in different places and to make sure that it doesn't expire. So let's just test and send ourselves a random quick audio message. I'm just gonna send this to myself. Now, there are a few different things that you can do here with this audio message. The default is that after two minutes after you listen to this audio message, it will automatically be deleted and you can't recover it. However, before you do that, before it gets deleted, you can tap that little keep icon right here and what this will do is it will make sure that that audio message is not deleted, but it will always stay in this text message string. So say if I deleted this text message thread, then that audio message is also deleted. If you want to, you can also just save it to the downloads on your iPhone, which I like to do because then it's backed up, then you have another place that you can keep it. So to do that, we're just gonna tap and hold on that audio message and we're gonna hit copy here. So once you hit copy, we're gonna get out of here and we're just gonna open up files. So the files app is default on your phone. It allows you to browse your iCloud drive, but also the files that are physically on your iPhone. So you can see at the very top, this is on my iPhone. What I can do here is just tap and hold and then hit paste. And you can see that it just pasted in that audio message. I can click on it, I can listen to it, I can send it to whatever I want, I can keep it, I can email it, text it, whatever I want to do with that audio message. So that's a really great way to keep that audio message. However, say if you get a bunch of these and you don't necessarily want to go through these steps every single time to save it, there's a setting on your iPhone to be able to save these audio messages and not have them expire. So to do that, let's just go into our settings here and we'll want to scroll down until we find messages. And then we want to scroll down again towards the bottom and you can see here audio messages and it says expire after two minutes and I can click on that and switch it to expire after one year. So that gives you a full year to be able to listen to that audio message before it will automatically be deleted. But keep in mind, you can always just save it onto the files like I just walked you through, and that will never be deleted off of your iPhone. Hope this helps. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below and make sure to subscribe. Thanks.